Hello friends, Kishan is here again and welcome you in this video tutorial. In this video tutorial, we are going to discuss about the infinite stream of custom type of elements. So here you can see in the slides, let's say that we want to create an infinite stream of random UIDs. So basically UUID is a class in Java and basically this class is used for the used to generate session id when you have a web based kind of application right the first step to achieving this using a steam api to create a supplier of those random values so we have a uuid and uuid class we have a static method is called random uid which is uh, used to basically generate a uuid I and mean uid uh, so we can refer this method by using method reference and this is the feature of uh, jdk 1.8 when you define a supplier we can create an infinite stream using the generate method and you have a in a stream class you have a generate method and here you are passing the reference of the random ui supplier and then you can take uh, n number of elements from this that stream we need to remember to use a limit method if we want to program to finish in a finite time right and from infinite stream of random uid just you are calling st and you are specifying value as 10 and finally you are limiting to 10 elements at a time and finally we are calling the terminal oper operator terminal terminal method is called collect and converting into list so let's open the eclipse and try to just create try to understand this code through an demo project so here i create a class is called infinite stream test this will have a main method over here and here what i will do uh, we have a we have a <coughs> uuid right uuid is a class and we can refer its method it called random sorry if you go to the uid then you have a call, method is called random uuid and this will return you uh, supplier instance supplier of UUID itself and you can give the variable name as random UU sorry UUID something like this Press Ctrl Shift O for organize import. So you got random UIDs and the random UIDs we can call method like generate. Generate sorry, we can call a stream st stream and we have a method is called generate right so we can call generate method here we can supply uh, supplier we can have supply the instance of this guy and this will give us the uh, instance of generate and generate method you can call a method like skip so skip and here we are going to specify value as 10 and again you are going to call limit you specify value as 10 <coughs> sorry for this and finally you will have to call collect method right collect here we have a collectors collectors dot as list sorry 
character dot to list so to list and we got this and finally you get this list and finally you can print this list right so if you try to print it using for each loop which gives you to uh, supply value for consumer that is system dot out and double colon print ln so this is a consumer and finally if you run it then you can see so you are able to generate 10 uuids by using its limit so let me exp explain this code snippet so here basically we have used here you can use you can see we have used uh, a skip transformation to discard first 10 results and take the next 10 elements we can create an infinite stream of any custom type elements by passing a function of supplier right uh, by passing a some uh, function of supplier interface to generate a method on a stream so if you want to generate I mean elements right finite is uh, so if you want to use I mean generate uh, I mean finite elements by using the infinite stream uh, of custom data type then you can use this of roach and if I go to the slide then next things in this slide uh, and that will be the final thing in uh, infinite stream so here you can see let's say that we have a simple while loop in our code like you have in a slice i value is 0 and i is less than 10 and you are printing the value of i and finally you are increment, incrementing this value by 1 so this will, loop will print from 0 to 9 right so we are printing here i counter 10 times we can expect that such construct can be easily written using the stream api and ideally we could have a do while method on the stream unfortunately there is no such methods on the stream and when we want to achieve functionality similar to a standard while loop we need to use limit method so similar functionality you can achieve in stream api using limit right so if uh, i can tie this code over here and explain to you so let's separate this output these two output and here I may use we have a stream right so here you can use a stream class and a stream method has a method is called iterate right so you can make use of iterate and here you can start from zero and every time you can increment i value with plus one right so this is a kind of lambda expression and this will return you a object of the stream itself now here I trade dot you can limit by 10 and you can apply for each loop right because this method is an intermediate uh, method and you can apply for each loop on this and you can print like system dot out colon double colon print elements basically you are supplying a uh, object of consumer and if i try to print it then successfully we can print from zero to nine so almost similar functionality which we were achieving through the while loop in uh, till JDK 1.7 from JDK 1.8 onwards similar functionality you can achieve through uh, a stream itself or using limit function. So here basically we have achieved the same functionality like an imperative while loop with less code but uh, call to the limit function is not as descriptive descriptive as it would be if we had a do while method on the stream object if we could have do while method in the stream class then we could have achieved this functionality but we don't have that kind of 
uh, I mean API in stream API. So same we can achieve through limit method, right? So that's all I wanted to show you in this video tutorial. And in next series of video tutorial, we'll come up with some um, more. We'll discuss about the more concept about stream API. And thanks for watching this video.